Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video. Welcome back to Road to IFO. And today... probably see in the back window here it is a little hazy so we're gonna go take care of that today my boy Zach Reese at enthusiast motorsports is hooking me up today I'm gonna go get the car completely redone retinted like you guys saw in the last episode I dropped off the wing to get painted and yes I did keep the I kept the carbon blade I'm keeping that carbon I'm getting the actual fiberglass sides sides um, and the part that actually attaches to the car I'm getting that actually all painted the same as the body color which is obsidian pearlescent black love it but that should be done here shortly and in the next video you guys are gonna see some more fun stuff that I'm doing to the car to get it ready for IFO but I hope you guys are enjoying this little series and I'm glad I could bring you guys along for the ride so in the meantime, sit back, relax, and I'll see you guys when I get there. as you guys can see in the background my boy Zach's already getting to work hard at work at that the uh, the previous owner or the previous owner before the previous owner whoever tinted this car it um, it wasn't like the best of film according to what Zach said but you guys can see here on the rear glass here on the work that he's already done so this is the actual film I think it was either this or this. Yeah, this is what actually came off of the rear window. Yeah, so it's like a half of it, I guess. But then he's got to go in there with, an, uh, with a knife and a razor blade, and then he's got to cut all this stupid freaking residue off. So I know he's got his, uh, he's got his work cut out for him tonight, literally. But... As <laughs> he's cutting out stickers, that's hilarious. But he's gonna get the car looking right. I know this thing looks so stupid right now. I'm I'm so frustrated with how this car looks, but I know in due time it'll look better. As of right now, he's gonna finish or work on tinting this tonight, going 20% all the way around. It's gonna look very good, the black on black. So hopefully I can get those figured out. And then as of for tomorrow's video, uh, I have the car is gonna go get the exhaust fixed on it. I have this really bad exhaust leak up front, which I'll show you guys. You guys can see here on the headers, I got a nice little crack going. So that's gonna get taken care of. That's gonna get taken care of by my friend, Mike. He does welding and stuff. And uh, he's also a fellow drifter. So I messaged him, he's gonna take care of that. But uh, in the meantime, like I said, Zach's gonna take care of the Subi. If you guys don't know Zach, used to own or still does own Enthusiast Motorworks, Motorsports, something like that, I think, right? Yeah, for, for a few more months. Yeah, for 
for the time being. I'm but give the company away. Yeah. As of right now, he's oh geez, I just threw that over there. My clip from my front bumper. <laughs> As of right now, he's working on my buddy Logan's stickers. You guys know Logan, all mischief, working hard. This is the uh, unfortunate part about driving a nice car on the highway. They got a nice crack there, which actually went and spider webbed all the way up to here, which sucks. And then I also have this guy that goes all the way across. I don't even know how well you guys can see that, but that's gonna get replaced on Friday while I'm at work, which is freaking awesome. It's so crazy to me to think that like, I dreamed of owning this car when I was nine, 10 years old. And I told my dad one day, I said, hey, we were, uh, we were actually at the 100 Acre Wood Rally out in Potosi or Salem, Missouri. And I actually told him, I said, hey, I wanna own one of these. Like, I'm gonna own one of those one day. And he was like, oh yeah, sure, okay. And fast forward X amount of years, um, I turned 19. And this car, this exact car actually showed up on Facebook Marketplace. And the gentleman that I bought it from, actually, I'm still, I still talk to him from time to time. And um, I think I'm the third owner of it, but he only owned it for a few months and it was like mainly, mostly parked. But it, the dream that I had for this car, you know, to kind of see it start forming its, vision that I've always wanted is really, it's stuff like this that makes it all worth it. Zach's just over here working away in his own little world. We just casually have a Viper sitting over here. I don't even know if I showed you this earlier. It's a casual little Viper. Look at the freaking brakes on this thing. Oh my God. And then in the rear, put on some nice mittos. But uh, you guys can see. Dude's got some needs, bro. Three forty-fives on this sucker, like, dude. That's like two of my hands. This thing's cool, though. What's up guys? I know it's been a little bit. Zach's been doing his thing back here. He is straight killing it. But I actually found out something that I didn't know. So I bought this car back when I turned 19. Um, and the taillights here, I bought it actually with the tinted taillights and everything and they're overlaid. And the gentleman I bought it for, um, I didn't know that he had it tinted. 
But uh, Zach went to go do the tent on the back window here. He lifted up the hatch and was like, who do you have these windows, these tinted by? I was like, I don't know. I bought it like that. Well, lo and behold, the gentleman I bought it for actually is the one that had it tinted like this. And these messages are way back from like 2017, 2018, 2019. Like, I think back in 2017. And then he just sent him a picture of full circle coming back to the same exact car years later down the road, getting it retended by my man, Zach. That is, that's what it's all about right there. Coming full circle. And it's funny that you even noticed it. You were just like, I saw you looking at it. And you're like. Well, Anthony and I had talked about the tent before, about redoing it. At the time, it, it still looked decent. I was like, dude, just let it go until it doesn't look good anymore. And then we'll redo it. Right. And it's like, I mean, this is from 2017, I think it was. Yes. And it still looks good as new. Like, there's not even, it's not peeling almost anywhere. Yeah. And I mean, it's a little foggy, but like, that's what's ex that's what it's expected. Like, if you look around the edges, like the vinyl's starting to pull back from where it was cut. Right. But, but it still looks, I mean, you, can, you can't notice it unless someone like you that does tint for a living walks up and looks at it. I thought, I thought the resin stopped. I was like, oh, cool. Oh, that's so funny. I legitimately thought that that shit was back in the that's crazy, dude. Full circle, years later. Wow. But anyways, he's finishing up the back window now. Ignore the... I, so I actually ended up dig covering these holes, and uh, it downpoured at work today. It's raining sideways! And uh, there was just a little bit of water, I think, in that light there. But uh, so far, looking really good. Hi, guys. Well guys, just finished up here. It's a little bit of a late night, but uh, heading home now. And let me tell you, you guys can't tell from the camera. The tent looks so good, dude. I'm so glad I did this. Oh man, but anyway guys, if you did enjoy the video, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. I know these videos are short, but it's a small little piece to the big puzzle. That is IFO, and you guys get to see the big reveal because I'm not gonna show you guys anything until IFO. But I wanna give Zach a huge freaking shout out, man. He is the freaking bomb, and he's actually been tinting both of my cars that I owned since I could freaking drive. And I, I wanna say his quality is unmatched. And I would never take my car to anyone else except him. Seriously, guys, make sure to check him out. I'll link him. I'll make sure to tag him down below. Check out his channel. Check out what he's all about. This car is coming together the exact way that I wanted it to from day one. And I love it. So I'll see you guys in the next video. So stay spooling, my friends. Peace out.